minus 30 seconds. Real time programs activated. Roger. Minus 25 seconds. Minus 20 seconds. 15 seconds. Moving towards the main topic of today's presentation, the question is why uh, we have to use INS or NAVIC when we already have GPS for free. All the experts say that no country can afford to depend upon the foreign country's constellation for navigation in the war scenarios and the same happened with India 17 years back. Year 1999 Location Kargil sector Jammu and Kashmir Taking advantage of their position, Pakistan army captured a good area of India. Heavy shellings by Pakistan army damaged ammunition depot in Kargil. Pakistan also shot down three fighter planes of Indian Air Force, the MiG-21, MiG-27 and Mi-17. Pakistan also bombarded the National Highway 1A. India lost hundreds of its soldiers. Indian Air Force also got a huge setback. After that, the first thing Indian military sought was the GPS data of the region. The space-based navigation system maintained by the US government would have provided a vital information. But the US suspended the GPS for both India as well as Pakistan. At that time, India realized how important it was to have our own navigation system. Before we jump to the conclusion that how anti-India US is, we should know that every coin has two sides. The another phase of the story is that US was actually trying to stop the start of nuclear war between both the countries. By not providing the GPS access, it slowed down the speed of attacks from both the sides. But this is not our cup of tea. We only know that if at that time India had Navi, the disaster would have been naturally less. According to the official figures given by the Indian government, 525 soldiers lost their life. 1365 soldiers were wounded, among which many got totally handicapped. Three fighter jets were shot down. One fighter jet crashed, one helicopter was shot down, and hundreds of tanks were destroyed. But finally, even after such a tremendous loss and without any GPS support, Indian Army won the Kargil War, and Indian Prime Minister Atal Bihari Vajpayee declared Operation Vijay successful, and at that day, ISRO saw one dream to build the IRNSS. In the memories of all the soldiers of the Kargil War and with the continuous hard work of the Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO, today all the Indians are very proud to have NAVI. Thank you.